Yo, what's going on guys? This is Baz here and today I'm going to be showing you how to stop input delay on your controller whilst you're playing on your PC. So, we're going to run a solos here and uh, yeah, let's get straight into the video. Yo guys, I forgot to say that if you're using a wireless controller, you're going to get input delay anyway. So always make sure to use a cable and uh, if you're still having input delay on PS4 or Xbox console, make sure to, yeah, uh, use a wire and uh, it should stop the issue. Yo, so when you're in the plane, you're on your controller and that, you will notice a slight in input delay on a controller, which is a big issue if you like to play on PC, like try and play as, like, as best as you can, basically, like competitive or whatever. So let me land and then I'll show you how to do it. Right, guys, so when you land, you'll notice there's a slight input delay, which is like critical if you're like trying to play good. It's awful. So to, to sort this out, uh, you go to settings up here, go to refrain rate limit and cap it. You need to cap the FPS. I think like some people said the lower the better, but if you're running 60, 60 FPS is probably the lowest you want to go. But if you're running like a 144 hertz monitor, run it at 144 hertz. And uh, it's pretty much instant then guys. It's uh, spot on it then. There's no input delay. And yeah. If it helped you out, make sure to like the video, subscribe if you're new, make sure to check out my How To Be Ali A video, it's super funny. And yeah, that's the end of the video guys, thanks for watching, peace.